So you mentioned Raspberry Pi, and that gets us into a good conversation. What's the difference between a Raspberry Pi and a microcontroller? Because I still want to talk about the Wi-Fi nugget. Uh, at the moment, about $200. But uh, okay. on a technical level, the Raspberry Pi is something that is a computer you can plug into, basically like a spare monitor, uh, plug in a keyboard, plug in a mouse, and you've got a computer. It runs an operating system. It runs programs that you're familiar with. It supports programming languages that you're familiar with. It's just a very full-fledged computer. And as a result, the price is supposed to be $35, but right now it's like more like $200 because there's a shortage. It's crazy. Um, and of course, there is a, sh a chip shortage that's affecting other areas, but I can still get a microcontroller that does like specifically Wi-Fi hacking for three bucks, five dollars. Um, and I can get, you know, something that does Wi-Fi and facial recognition for five bucks, you know? So like the fact that I can get a Wi-Fi connected camera that does facial recognition had like all it has all these peripherals is so cool to me that I was very um, initially attracted to the Raspberry Pi as like the, my preferred solution for hacking. My goal has always been as cheap as possible. Like I never had much money when I got started hacking and I never wanted to do anything or teach anything that was so expensive that people who were just getting started wouldn't be able to do it. So if you fry a Raspberry Pi, it sucks, you know, like you mourn it a little yeah. bit because like that thing's like kind of expensive. It has a personality and I have enough now that I don't have to be precious about them, but I still like feel the loss of a Raspberry Pi. These little things are anonymous, you know, like I fry so many of these because I'm always experimenting with them and I'm hooking stuff up to them that I shouldn't be. And I don't care because I get a bag of a hundred of them. It's really cool to be able to scale ideas as well. Um, and not be bottlenecked by tons of cash. So perfect segue into the Wi-Fi nugget. Like we've been creating this little cat shaped packing tool that at its core is using these microcontrollers to be able to do all the magic stuff that it does. And the cool thing about it is we can make, you know, a hundred, a thousand of them. Um, and we don't have to be a huge company because unlike somebody who's buying up a hundred or a thousand Raspberry Pis, you know, I don't have to have a hundred thousand dollars to make a bunch of these and bring them to a conference and show people all the cool stuff that they can do.